I love talking about metrics and I love talking about burning the boat metrics because support, I mean, if you talk about support from you know, the 1980s forward, it, control and compliance, those were the metrics. It was all about control and compliance all the way. It was time to resolution, time to response, um, you know, CSAT, which, which is a great metric, don't get me wrong. Uh, but if by the time you get a CSAT survey, it's too late. Everything should have happened already well before that CSAT survey. Um, so today's metrics and, and you know, there's a, a, a balanced scorecard that we produced years ago. Uh, we did it, a uh, number of industry leaders, um, John Ragsdale, TSIA, Phil Burgess from Clever, et cetera. It's called OCMF Group. And it's a balanced scorecard for how we can get to metrics that matter. And while support is always going to have to measure those other things because it, it matters and you have to be able to know how you're doing, getting to the new metrics, getting to metrics around, for instance, collaboration, go ahead and get there, right? That's a touchy feely. You know, if you want to talk about an interesting metric, so, you know, John, if I'm having a problem, and I reach out to you, how interesting is it that I could actually give you a score on how well you collaborated with me in solving that problem, right? Uh, right. And, and so it makes me want to reach out to you again in the future. And it makes you, if I've scored you positively, willing to help me, right? And so look at that culture that you're creating. Um, so there's that, there's, you know, Greg Walker, who is one of our product managers, teases me. But one of my favorite metrics that there's still not enough adoption for, things like customer effort. Are we making it easy for our customers? Employee effort. Why are we so afraid to measure? Them? Like, are we making it easy for our employees to do their jobs? 